So several African Americans have uh, gotten their citizenship in African nations. Ludacris got uh, his national. Uh, he got a uh, his real name is Christopher Bridges. Uh, he celebrated Christmas in Gabon and he received his citizenship there. Uh, his wife is Gabonese. Gabonese, I think that's how you say that. Mm-hmm. Um, and many other African Americans are, including Cardi B. She says she's considering applying for a Nigerian citizenship. Mm. Did you see that? I heard about that. Um, yeah, the radio. Bronx rapper, she tweeted, um, this ish ain't no joke, especially being from New York. Uh, it's sad that the man is putting Americans' lives in danger. Dubbest move Trump did to date. I'm filing for my Nigerian citizenship. Would you leave this country and become a citizen of another land? Um, and on that note, uh, there's also a an actress from Orange is New Black. She just gave up her green card. For other reasons, but there seems to be we we talked about Naomi Osaka. She yeah. gave up her American citizenship for, and I get it. Her mom's Japanese. It's probably easier. Would you leave this country? If so, where would you go? Would you relinquish your American citizenship? A lot of people got a lot of things to say about America. Are you willing to give up your citizenship? Eight six six eight zero one eight two five five. I understand what you're saying, Drew. Yeah. See, I'm not willing to have, give up my citizenship. Yeah, that, but, but hey, you can't have both. If you can't have both, what, if I can't have both, if you both, can't have both, we'll it talk about on how it. Bad it. Just is. think about it. Yeah. Eight six six eight zero one eight two five five. Yeah. People talk a lot. Yeah. What are you willing to do? I've lived outside of the country though. I know you have. You've so, been. You've lived in China. Whatever. Yeah. So what are so, you saying? Let's talk I'm about what China. Talk about. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Where would you go? So what sacrifices am I going to make? Good question. To begin with, I'd like to announce that. I'm giving up my green card. After a long considered process, we've come to understand that it's unethical for us to set up a life in two countries knowing what we know. The carbon emissions alone from that flying, it's unethical, it's not right. So I will be going through the process of giving up my green card and saying goodbye to a life in America. I'm gonna be here in Australia doing the work I can to make a difference here, because the time is now. Like I said, this is war, and we've only got 10 years. So let's make these sacrifices. Let's make these changes. Let's put some skin in the game and say, yeah, I care. And this is what I'm gonna do about it. This is just the beginning for me. That's Yale Stone. She is one of the actresses in Orange is New Black. She played Lorna Morello last season. Um, She got pregnant, lost a baby, went crazy. Uh, Really amazing six-year run that she had. Apparently, she had dual citizenship, not dual citizenship. She had a green card, which allowed her to be in America to work permanently. Uh, And she's given that up to fight climate in Australia. Now, that's quite a different question than what I put on the table. Um, Drew mentioned if stuff gets hot and heavy here, he's looking to expatriate someplace else. Mm -hmm. I'm here to fight because I believe that this country was built on the backs of people, uh, that come from me and I'm not willing to walk away from it. Not only that, but I think we, we create the world that we want to live in and running, uh, when it gets hot. Or in her case, I think she what she's doing is really she's running into the heat. She's running into the heat. And yeah. I love that. I love that she cares enough about this planet. There, we got several things going on in this world right now. You know, that climate thing is real. What she's talking about is 10 years. That They're saying it's 10 years. Uh, that's all we have. There's limited water all over the country, all over, excuse me, the world. Yeah. There's a lot of things happening with climate. That, that earthquake that we talked about yesterday, another one hit Puerto Rico today. Things are happening globally that have everything to do with our carbon footprint. This woman, it seems like a small thing, but it's a lot. If we all had the same attitude. The same level of personal sacrifice. Yes. The other question is, are we living in a nation so toxic that it's untenable? That's what Drew is like. Yeah. If it becomes untenable, you want an exit strategy. Yeah. But I feel like even in relationships, as long as you have an exit strategy, your level of fight diminishes because if you know you can always leave a situation which you can we're free right yeah we all have free will how 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 hard do you fight for something if you in the back of your mind know that you can leave it i do want to say that i think that she is the epitome of what what you think about as a patriot though someone who has a very good life somewhere else who is going home to go fight 
that is patriotism. Someone who leaves where they are comfortable to jump into the fight for their fellow man, their mm. fellow Australian or their fellow American. Right. That is patriotism at, to me, the highest level.